Welcome to Support Videos for Workload Automation Video Series. We are going to discuss how to manage run as credentials via the command line. These are the users that are used in your jobs. Um, some of you may have referred to them as the job owners. We are going to use the CTM set on utility on the control room server. This utility allows us to manage the users as well as import and export credentials between different control room environments. Typically when you want to create or modify a run as user, you'd go into the CCM under security, you go to the run as user settings. We can also do this command line using the CTM set on utility, which we discussed earlier. We know that on the host cycle, we want to add the user root. So we're going to do ctm set on minus action add minus run underscore as root minus host cycle minus password and the password is control m and i can look at my output and realize that i actually did something slightly different than the password so let me go change that and I actually have a control m and as you notice, it said this not already existed. So what we're going to do is we're actually going to change our action to update. And there we go. And we can see what users exist by running the CTM set own minus action list. Now I know I have another user CTM 700P, which exists on several machines in my environment that I use to test. So let me go ahead and add this user real quick. And to speed up typing, we're just going to go up to our existing one right here. And we're going to change this to CTM 700P. And in this particular case, I want to do this for all hosts. So I'm going to do this by using the all. And I have to double quote it because of the greater than and less than. And this particular user has a password, it's just his username. And if I go ahead and run my action list again, I will see that that user is now added in there for all. Thank you for your time. The Workload Automation Support Team looks forward to helping you should you need our assistance.